for joining us tonight. The Oregon Soccer Club is unsure if it's of its future if a proposed $4 million sports complex goes through. That topic brought up tonight at a board meeting. Amy Reed joins us now to explain why they hope the village reconsiders. This project has been developing since 2016. There have been multiple versions of the plan, and the latest has only two fields that could be used for soccer. But with 900 kids in Oregon Soccer Club, the president of the club said that doesn't work. There's only so many more days like this. Good fall weather for the kids to play. It's definitely concerning. Eric Anderson worries time may be shorter still as the village of Oregon looks to convert J.C. Park West into a $4 million sports complex, cutting the number of soccer fields here from nine to zero. There is no definitive plan in place right now. Um, for a future home for this club that's uh, been part of the community since 1978 and has grown by leaps and bounds and um, you know provides a great uh, a great service for for kids growing up it wasn't always like this in the years this plan has been in motion there were versions of it that had four soccer fields not ideal for a club that already fills this space um, so we wrote the village this letter um, outlining those those questions and concerns and um, yeah after that the the plan changed quite a bit and the soccer fields um, were no longer there. Instead, new plans showed two shared fields for football, rugby, lacrosse, and soccer. And then we went back to the village and we said, well, what's going on with the soccer fields? And they said, well, we took, took it from your letter that you no longer wanted to participate. Now he's hoping the village board will change its mind. Not only does he not know if this new plan will allow them to continue play like this as usual, the annual tournament, the group's main fundraiser, won't continue as it is now, putting the future of scholarships and fees for the sport in question too. He gets the perks of new fields and better drainage. They're soggy even today, but he wants this to be a space for all kids. And under this plan, he says that's not what it is. I think the biggest concern is where exactly the soccer fields will go. Where will the soccer players and teams go? We asked multiple members of the village board to do an interview with us about this today, and they all said no. At a meeting tonight, they said they hope to put money toward more parks in the future that would give space for more fields.